How's it going YouTube? This is Captain, and in today's video, I'm gonna teach you guys how to get a Chatot, Bronzong, and Chimeco in Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver. So let's get started. You will need the national decks for each of these three Pokemon. So if you don't have that, get that and come back to this part of the video. Otherwise, you're ready to go. So for Chatot, there are three locations you can find it in. These all require Sinnoh Sound, which only happens on Thursdays after getting the national decks. But if it is a Thursday and you're ready to catch yourself a Chatot, here are three of its locations where you can find it at. But in this video, I'm just going to go over location number one, which is to fly to Violet City and find it in Sprout Tower, which is where I'm at right now. Head up this ladder. And now it's time to tune into our Poke Gear, so let's do that. You'll want to tune into the top left station here, the Pokemon Music Channel. And you will go ahead and do some encounters until you encounter a chat talk. And first encounter, there's our level 3 Chatot. I made this nickname in 2015, don't judge me please. Level 3 Chatot, it's an easy catch. Just go ahead and throw a Quick Ball at it or an Ultra Ball. I recommend Quick Ball because in all my tutorials that's been the most successful one and I've made quite a few of these. What? Okay, hold on, maybe I spoke too soon. Okay, yeah, please do yourselves a favor and catch it in Sprout Tower. This took way longer than I was expecting. Chatot's catch rate is apparently pretty low, so yeah, there you go. So once that's done, you're all done with Chatot. So as for Bronzong, you'll want to fly on over to Victory Road. And once you're at Victory Road, just head into the gate and go into the actual Victory Road itself. So once you're at Victory Road, tune into your Poke Gear, and it should be playing the Sinnoh sound on the DJ Band Pokemon Music Channel. If it isn't, that means it's not a Thursday, and you'll have to wait for a Thursday by either setting your system to a Thursday if it's not a Thursday, or if it is, just go ahead and just use it. So let's see if we can find ourselves a Bronzor. And there it is, level 32. Okay, first try, no worries here. So once you've caught Bronzor, all you have to do is level it up once. I would recommend heading into this left gate and giving your Bronzor an EXP share. And since I've got a level 100 Ho-Oh by my side, I can just go ahead and sweep the Pokemon in here, or even in the Elite Four if you wanted to. And after Bronzor levels up once, you will have your Bronze on. As for Chimeco, you don't need either of Hoenn Sound or Sinnoh Sound. All you have to do is fly on over to the Safari Zone, and you'll have two options from there. So option one, you go for Chingling and level it up to maximum happiness to get it to Chimeco, or you could catch Chimeco straight away, and I'll go ahead and cover both of those methods. As for Chingling, you'll want to head over to the Area Customizer, and go ahead and place the Mountain Area, which I already done. And for Chimeco, you'll want to place the Swamp area. I don't have it placed already, so I'll go ahead and place it now. There it is. And now that I've placed them both, I can go ahead and catch Chingling and Chimeco if I wanted to. You don't have to catch both, it's entirely up to you. And let's just head on in. Once you're in the mountain area, all you'll need to do is place 10 forest objects. So just press A anywhere that's empty. They should be at the bottom of the first menu. They should be the tree, branches, and stump. So once you've placed all your forest objects, go ahead and search for Chingling. And there we have it, there's our Chingling. And I caught it with my first ball, I got lucky there. So once catching Chingling, your Chingling will be at happiness 70, and now you want to get it to a max happiness of 255. I'll link a happiness guide by Frost over on Sipokes.com in the description. Once you hit max happiness, just level up Chingling at night, which is from 8pm to 4am, 
and that'll evolve it into Chimeco. Or, of course, you could avoid all of that process by simply heading over to the swamp area that we put up earlier, and here you'll want to place 15 forest objects. After placing all 15 of your forest objects, go ahead and check the grass for Chimeco. And there it is. Chimeco can be very difficult to catch since it's at a very high level. And yeah, it can flee on you. Later. Please? Please? Oh man, that took so long. Let's go. I used 8 safari balls, but finally caught it. And yeah, that's it for this video. Let me know if it helped by leaving a like down below, and comment if you guys have any questions. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.